Hi, I'm Joel Ader from Washburn University. We're here to talk about this year's KMEA excerpts. So let's start with the Mozart. A very difficult excerpt here from Mozart. It has to be um, very rhythmic, very accurate, very consistent um, tempo-wise. You have to make sure that the tempo of your first four measures lines up exactly with the tempo of bar five when you start the 16th notes. I hear a lot of students start this excerpt too fast, and then when you get to the 16th notes, uh, you, you slow down because it gets more difficult. Uh, so be wary of that. A very precise rhythm in bars 10, 11, 12. I give a little bit of um, a little bit of accent on the 16th note that's after the rest to make sure that it, it's articulate and it comes out. Um, uh, measure 13, those forte pianos are, are definitely correct, they're accurate. Um, so after you hit the D, you have to drop down to piano. Um, and then the forte in, in measure 14 um, is, is sudden, it's a new dynamic. So we're strong there again. Um, uh, you may have noticed I play the, f the top two notes of the chord in measures 15 and 17. I don't play the bottom note, and that's sort of common practice for auditions. I mean, if there's a triple stop, you probably you wouldn't play all of the notes just, just like um, as if you were playing it in the section in, in, in orchestra. Uh, it, usually you would just play the top note. You can play the, 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 the middle note if, if it's feasible to do so. So that's what I'm doing in this case. Um, Second excerpt, the Carmen. Uh, this is the suite from the famous opera, of course. Uh, a really great moment in the opera where, where uh, people are at a tavern, they're having a party, and things sort of escalate and people get on, on the tables and they start dancing. The tempo of the music gets faster. So this is the moment when things, uh, when things get really crazy. It's a high energy excerpt. Um, notice it's fortissimo, triple forte all the way through. So you have to uh, convey that char character in the, in the playing. Um, be very uh, consistent, of course, with your tempo. Make sure your, your eighth notes with, with the dots are very articulate and, and, and short. Um, let's see, and just, um, and really just conveying the dynamic, the character all the way to the, to the end. The Dvorak, of course, this is the beautiful slow movement from the New World Symphony. Um, this is the middle section of the slow movement um, where we go into C-sharp minor. Um, you want to be very lyrical in your playing, but also you, you have to convey the, the, the anxiety that's in the music, sort of yearning, anxiety, um, that sort of goes towards measure four, the forcissimo in measure four, and sort of dissipates. But you have to sustain your sound um, really connect your sound and make sure you're vibrating on on really every note of of this short excerpt um, to to convey that sort of melodic aspect. Um, obviously, show your dynamics. You start soft, you get loud in the middle, and then and then we get soft to the end again. So it sort of builds that way. Um, and also, make sure you don't play this excerpt too slow. It still has to have a very flowing tempo to it. Um, in the description section of this, this video, you'll find a link to um, fingerings and, and bowings uh, that, that I've made um, that talks about a lot of stuff that, that I mentioned in this video. Um, and happy practicing, and I hope you do great on your audition.